Good morning, today is cruise day and I'm so excited. It is 3.30 in the morning. My ride is gonna be here very soon. I am catching the Brightline down to Miami. Just packing my last few minute thing. Let's take the Brightline, it's my first time taking it. Brightline's still very new, just opened up in September. Let's check this out. Fiasco fam, we are here at Virgin Voyages, about to embark on my first Virgin Voyages cruise. Wait, I said that like a tongue twister. <laughs> Virgin Voyages cruise. We are here celebrating my homegirl's birthday. We're gonna get her on camera once she takes a nap, once <laughs> I take a nap too. It's been a very long day. We caught the bright line bright and early at 3.45 a.m. to get down to Miami, but we're here. We're gonna have a great time. <laughs> I'm so excited. We found her room. Let me nosy. Can I come in? Ew. This is nice. Y'all. Oh, mm. wow. I really need that in the view. But you know what? It's whatever. Girl, it's okay. You have a hammock and all that. Version. I did not get a balcony room, but I wanted her balcony room. She has a hammock. She has a, what I believe is a limited sea view. But she'll be all right. This is still gonna be a fabulous view once you go ahead and get all the water and everything outside. We have Royal Caribbean, Laura of the Seas, in Port with us today as well. I'm just really happy. Y'all know cruises are my thing. It's such a simple vacation. Week after I get back from this trip, I'll be in India celebrating New Year. So it's gonna be a lot of moving and shaking for the month of December. But I'm so excited and I hope that you like and subscribe to the channel and join with us. holiday selling. We have an ugly sweater PJ party tonight. Kind of holiday festivities. I'm excited. I'm excited to see my room. I feel like it's about to be like super cool, tiny. They have a full crack of water inside the refrigerator. Did you see that? Oh, inside the fridge? Yeah, the fridge. inside the fridge. Good, because I... a full crack of water. And I brought I um, liquid IVs too, just I in case. I too. Okay, good, because we're going to be hydrated because yeah. we're going to be drinking with hydrated. Let's do this. All right, Let's see what this looking like. Okay. Got a little bird doopy on the window. Right smack dab on the window. You know what, that's a sign of good luck. They said when birds poo poo. Got a nice view of Miami. So as it got to my room, it's cute. It's a little bit, it's cute. I'm in a solo sea view cabin. We're greeted with bird poo, but that's okay because that's a sign of good luck. A beautiful view of Miami. It's cute in here for a solo. And I'm glad I got a window. I don't think I could do without having a window. Excited, all the options. Try not to be selfish. You're not selfish, like greedy, I guess I should say. So I got sushi and tacos. Probably come back later for the um, ramen. Cheers. Not mad at it. Let me eat lunch. I'll be back. But just walking around exploring the ship, just ate a quick lunch over at the galley. Really, this view of Miami. Miami is one of my favorite cities. On this side, y'all, check out this view of Miami, though. Love it. So I think this is where they do yoga at, so I'm hoping to come out here tomorrow a.m. Apparently, I need to sign up and I need to do that quickly. Have I done that yet? No. But will I do it? Absolutely. This bracelet, but I have this extra bracelet here because they actually match my platinum status with Carnival, so deep blue something. So everybody maybe has 300 bar tabs. Uh, money on bar tab, but they gave me an additional $100. So that's $400 worth of alcohol. So basically $100 worth of alcohol drinks a day in like five days. Can I do it? Yes. Is it smart for me to do it? Probably not, but we're gonna do it. First drink of the trip. Cheers again. <laughs> Happy birthday. Oh, oh, this is actually like, this is nice. Ooh, oh, oh. Uh, <laughs> you want my knee? Oh, no, <laughs> <laughs> Doing it with no hands. <laughs> Y'all, I just did a, what is this called? Teeter-totter? What is this called again? Seesaw. Seesaw. Where did, teeter-totter? Where did I get that from? It's a champagne, it's coming, it's coming. It's tequila and champagne gonna mix together. Find out later on in this vlog. <laughs> you talk about how empty it feels. I know that we're not fully at capacity, but it feels it feels nice. Like You don't feel like you're on top of each other, kind of like how it would typically feel on carnival, especially at the buffet, because there's no buffet. We just have the galley over here. 
initial thoughts, it's pretty damn big. Every corner we turn around, there's another bar. There's something more to eat. My second tequila soda. And we had to make a little pit stop to grab something to eat. I might get the goat cheese polenta, the chicken thigh, and the hanger steak. I'm enjoying myself. <laughs> I'm enjoying myself. It's been nice having this little thing, just tapping it to pay for my drinks, using the bar tap. I'm not mad at it. celebrating her birthday. That's why we're here. You'll see her in Croatia next year too. So that's exciting. This is Hugh and Jay and this is our third drink. <laughs> we're hanging in there. Drinks are really strong too. So it's not like it's like a cheap drink. It doesn't water down at all. I think my little secret little this is my third one, eight dollars. And that's why I will pay back home anyway. We have four hundred dollars to use up. So and then like I love the fact that you just tap it and you don't have to sign anything. So that pressure of gratuity yeah. Is not there because the tips are included. It I forgot included. about that. Okay, so we got the goat cheese polenta, the hanger steak, and she got Make sure those shrimp. Chicken I think she just made it. What a crazy few hours this has been. I'm already three tequila sodas in. I am back in my room. I just got my luggage. I am going to try to quickly unpack before I go to my solo meetup me and my friend were selling together but she's one cabin up she has the um balcony that you guys saw i'm in a solo cabin i'm in a s that's the sound i'll be back Hold on. i just wanted to give a really quick cabin tour because i was not able to do that earlier so we're gonna do that real quick before our solo meetup okay so let's start at the very 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 beginning we are in cabin. A closet, you have this. This is it's for a solo cabin. I'm really impressed with the space here to put my things. So I'm gonna pack, yes, I did bring two suitcases for a five day cruise, but me and my, my, me and my, me and my, me and, can I call him that yet? I don't know. This dude I'm dating. <laughs> We're gonna spend a couple days in Miami afterwards. So I just needed options because I hate not having options for stuff. Anyway. Here is the closet with this. I'm gonna push that here. There's a full wardrobe here as long as the safe and life jacket. Plenty of drawer space. Another full size mirror, here I am. Here's another full space mirror. Like I said, this, this space here is really big. Bathroom, pretty tiny. Would I wanna share the space with one other person? Probably would not wanna share the space with one other person, but for just for me, it's fine. Head into my bedroom space. Here is the bed, my TV, there's my mirror, here is my desk, I have water, I have space, I have this, I have that, I got this and a, this and a, that, and um, I have a fridge with nothing in it. I have this little side table here, here is my curtains, I can close this, this is a really big uh, window. I have bird poop on the window because it's going to be a really good cruise. Here is beautiful Miami. I am looking forward to waking up and seeing a different view outside this window every single day. I am so excited. This is the room. What you see is this. I think this is the perfect space for just one person. Of course, because it's solo. Hello, hello, we're at Salaway and it's loud. We have a free champagne waiting to sell away right now. And I hope that champagne and tequila mixes later. I don't know. We'll see. We're supposed to have dinner reservations in nine minutes. I don't think we're gonna make it. I don't think that's gonna happen, but we'll see. It's irrational. It's irrational. We didn't know Salaway happened this late, so they're gonna have to just redo us. Are we moving? Who's eating dinner? It's 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 Salaway time. It's drink away time. It's free champagne time. It's champagne o'clock.
dinner reservation for Razzle Dazzle at 6, 6.30, but we didn't know that Celebrate didn't take off till like, I don't think we're still moving, it's 6.31. So that was, oops, our bad. One more drink. You ain't, ain't nothing but a word. Drink. Hey, Bobby. Bobby. But Charlie, I need a microphone. Bobby, I think I'm going to remember soda, but my fifth drink. Slapping at this black ball. I, I saw that too. <laughs> We need to grow up. We're at Razzle Dazzle, buy tequila sodas in. Why is, why is your so tiny? No. Fair, no, I, no, no, no. <laughs> no, 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 I'm good. <laughs> oh, yeah. Old Bay chicken wings, tartar, natural hot cauliflower, green goddess sour, pork belly, Q. <laughs> so like I said, Verona, tis the seed sun. Selling, so it's Christmas theme, holiday theme, whatever you celebrate themed. The hallways, lights are red and green. I am so tired. I'm trying to push through because the pajama party is at 9.45 and it's currently 8.27. And I don't want to assume anything, so I want to be like, if you've seen this vlog already, we'll come down here. If you've seen this vlog, you already know. So here's the tablet. So this is the, let's get it all. Yeah, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Photo shoot, nice and bright. Then, I'm trying to find something that's not gonna put me to sleep. This will definitely put me to sleep. Pumped up, not very pumped up lighting. Hang over, we're gonna go unpack. We are gonna go take a shower and we are gonna try not to fall asleep before this party. I'm gonna try to stay up. It's 11.20, kinda slept right through the pajama party that they moved to 11, they moved it from outside to inside. Once they moved it back a little bit, I said I ain't going. I'm gonna go to sleep. Today's been a fun first day. We've been up since three. We've been moving and grooving since then. I'm gonna try to go to yoga in the morning. It's just been a very crazy day. I'm so excited for Scrooge. I love it so, 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 so much so far. But I deserve rest. I really do. Everything's not about content. Sometimes it's about rest too. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Bye. Very good morning from day two. About 7.45. Up. We're up. We have workout gear on. He was convinced something's gonna pop out. It does. I just like how warm it is. Mr. Bird, Mr. Bird, you like, hello. My name is Richard Branson. Good morning. Sorry I did not vlog. So I think when I last left you guys, I was actually headed off to yoga. I did not want to film in a yoga studio because we were supposed to do it upstairs, but this morning was mad windy, mad cloudy. I think you guys saw it, but I'm looking outside right now. It looks like the sun is coming out. So after yoga, got something to eat real quick. And now I'm back in the room, about to change it to my swimsuit. I kind of need to unpack still. I said I was going to do that last night. But y'all saw I took a shower out directly in my bed. I'm gonna take a quick shower, change to my swimsuit, and then um, let's go lay out and get some drinks because I barely put a dent into my little wallet alcohol thing. But we are gonna put a dent in it today. See you in a second. Before I go shower, I just wanna show off my, like I've really made this place home. I have this little section, it's like what I have at home, so I love it. I have my birth control, cause I gotta stay regular in that. My chapstick, I cannot go to sleep without my chapstick. I love how they have water, I have my camera charger my lint roller, my liquid IVs up here. I have my sound machine from home, my speaker. I, I made this little section home and then I went ahead and unpacked. So I have just some shoes here. My dresses are here too and some purses. And I keep everything kind of in my packing cube still in that. So yeah, but to yoga this morning, like I said, it was a fit for yoga. Yoga has like transformed my body. I feel so much stronger. My arms look, hold on. You see that? I know it may not look like much, but hopefully I don't have that much muscle like ever. Let me go take a shower finally. Put on my bathing suit because the sun is out. And we're back on camera because I forgot it in the room and then we went to the pool and we had a couple of drinks and then I took a little cat nap And what else did we do? We we'll go smell some perfumes This is the Gucci floral purple bottle. It kind of smells like grass a little bit But now we're gonna go do a puzzle competition. It's all Hugh's idea. I suck at puzzles You know what time it is? It's red book time 
We tried to go to the puzzle thing, but we just found it, and we they start the on time. Yeah, we 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 on ethnic time because. <laughs> They started very much on time. We arrived three minutes late and they were already set together their puzzles. So welcome to the champagne life or kettle ones I like to call it. Dream, same reality, I mean one of the same. The ship is rocking so bad right now. Like I told y'all it's mad windy. I don't know why I'm looking outside because I can't see anything. But just know the ship is rocking so badly right now that they just canceled dual reality for tonight. They also had to reschedule yoga this morning too because that was supposed to be outside. So they had to move us inside. And then the boy band dance class that was supposed to be outside of the perch also got canceled because of the wind. It's been windy all day. But like I don't know you see me rocking back and forth like I'm swaying right now really really bad. Now hear me guys on camera. I'm saying I'm only spending $20. $20 and $20 only. Do not let me go in this in casino and mess around with her and I spent more than twenty dollars because if I spend more than twenty dollars I might as well just throw money off the side of the ship mm -hmm. might as well take my oh oh so the lights change oh. are we swaying yes we're gonna take a little break from drinking because we're already swaying enough everything is getting canceled because it's windy and we're swaying but we're gonna just flow through it just left the casino and talk to me nice because i just want forty dollars and cash out immediately and talk to ton ton hugh yeah, full ton name miss ton hugh gotta get the full name i want four dollars and two cents <laughs> four dollars and forty dollars and we're going straight I'll to the louis vuitton see the louis one. yeah we're about to pick them up forty dollars we won <laughs> Just left Gumbe for dinner. It was delicious. Very fun. 8.30. I'm tired. I'm going to take a nap. I'm going out tonight. I'm going to force myself to go out. Q is not feeling well right now. The ship is rocking like hell. I ain't gonna lie to you. It's rocking. I don't know how I don't feel it because I didn't take any Dramamine. But she took a Dramamine and some essential oils to the temple and neck and stuff. I took that too. out one of these nights i swear just not tonight not yesterday night not tonight the ship is just rocking way too much friend was not feeling good so she left dinner early it's not making me feel sick but it's i feel like i'm literally being rocked to sleep i came in a room and i was like i'm just going to take a nap it was like nine and like i know the club didn't open till like 10 45 i was like i'm just going to take just a nap it's never just a nap it's never just one drink it's never just a nap i went to sleep and now it's 12 and there's this band i want to see that starts at 12 15 like i need virgin to be for real like i am tired <laughs> my thing starts so late yeah i'm gonna have to come back on this cruise line because there's a lot of stuff i need to do including going to the clubs and stuff but i just don't have it in me right now because i'm tired i'll do better tomorrow thank you guys Good morning from Puerto Plata. 
Dominican Republic. I feel very fresh today because all I've been doing the last two days was sleeping. Yesterday on the ship was so rocky, even up until like 8 a.m. this morning. I had to wake up in the middle of the night at like 3 a.m. and take a drop of me myself. And I felt fine yesterday until I got back in the room. We have a short excursion today, so I'm trying to be somewhat kind of cute. But let's get ready. Let's see how cute we can actually get today. today is Florida Seas. I think they were in port with us in Miami too. And there's our beautiful ship too. Heading off to rum drink and dance, basically. but I needed it. My stomach, the pits of my stomach is burning and it's on fire and I ate this morning. Whew. I just tasted all of my tongue, all different kinds. I was mixing white rum with the brown rums and coconut and the pina and the, it was just a lot going on. So lunch comes with this tour and I know that we're going to supposed to go doing dancing or something. As long as lunch comes with it, we'll be all right. That was also my dumb fault for not bringing water. Next time, bring a water bottle, be like you. Bring, <laughs> bring your giant, Stanley cup of water, bring something. I know sunglasses, I have no water bottles. Like I'm doing this trip all kind of wrong. Dropped us off at one of these like places. You know how these like tourist places, they're like, here, go shop here. You're like, you know? Yes. 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 Mm -hmm. yes. That's a communion drink. Adult beverages. It's day three, baby. We have Scarlet Night tonight, so I'm glad the sun's back out. The rain's never last long. Great tour today. I'm tired. Need oh, a shower, yeah. take a quick little nappy nap, and then get ready for Scarlet Night. We're gonna stay up. I'm gonna stay up. I keep saying on Instagram, I'm gonna stay up. And if people like y'all start to take your own little polls if I'm gonna stay up or not, and I'm not appreciating that, I see it. Okay, the last two nights y'all did win, but tonight you're not gonna win. We're gonna be outside tonight, okay? Because I slept for two days, two days straight. So we're gonna be outside because it's raining. This is God telling me to rest, relax, you know? So we're gonna do that. So I'm gonna go shower, do all that because it's very raining outside. This is not go outside weather. So let's, let's get a shower going. I am 
I'm all ready for Scarlet night. Look at me leaving. The room past nine o'clock or eight something, it's eight. But here's the dress. It's giving rolling down a river. It's like a great nap. I can't spend the entire cruise just chilling in my room. We going out, we going out. Okay, just dancing. Dancing, getting ready, it has me tired. <laughs> not watch the dancer stands because we want to watch the dancer stands and we can do it at a show so that's like so far my only critique you see how everybody's like really still and everybody's like the only people having fun right now or the people that's actually dancing in the show but people want to come out here and drink and dance and that's it Y'all don't bully me to going now, so I went out because of y'all. And the music was giving 2000 house party. Black music for white people. Yeah, that, yeah. Oh. nailed it. Nailed it. That's my only critique that Carnival does better. It's the music. This music is meant for not a, a certain demographic, and it's not mine. <laughs> so we're gonna go check out a band, and we're hoping that they're better than that DJ. Another dual loofah. Right. They're starting off very poorly. I have pizza. I am about to take the quickest shower because I feel dirty. And watch the Barbie movie with my pizza. And I'm so excited. I would not catch me watching a movie back home. Tomorrow's gonna be better. Uh, Scarlet Night and going out. Did not enjoy that. Did not like it at all. And that's okay. Cause just cause I don't like it, you might love it. You very much might love it. Talking too much, my piece again. Kong, take a shower. We're gonna see y'all in a few minutes. Bye. start to the day when I tell y'all I haven't done nothing but relax on this cruise and eat that's all I've been doing today is another sea day um we're heading towards Bimini but tomorrow's our last day already I'm very sad so I need to come back on this cruise and do all the things that I didn't get a chance to do before I have no doubt no doubt version that I will be back um but I was kind of tired from this cruise and from the year and I have India coming up so soon so I really just needed to relax 
and that's what I did. Going upstairs right now because it's a beautiful day outside. I'm gonna eat breakfast and head out on the pool deck. Let's go. It's been a nice seat day. Kind of overclass, but it's nice. Y'all, we've been trying to go to this place. He came to see me for like days on the show. Now they're finally open, so we got a poke bowl right by the pool. Mm. My shadow's all up in it. That looks so good. Just up by the pool, but I wanted to make sure before I eat my salad, get comfortable before my next activity, I wanted to say this. The music on the ship is not diverse at all. And I know that everybody works on contracts, so maybe right now we don't have like a very diverse um, DJ list or something, but sitting by the pool and they play like a little bit of like Bob Marley for like two songs and they played a little bit of hip hop for like two songs. And then they dove straight into like, I've been sitting out by the pool at least since like, 10 30 and it's like 2 30 right now i just came back took a shower right so you that dj played nothing but hours of spanish music and that's nothing against reggaeton and spanish music i don't want to hear bad bunny's extended version of the album don't want to hear it but like if you have a diverse group of people enjoying the sun and drinking and eating your playlist needs to reflect the crowd uh, there was a crowd of black people that were sitting behind me at the pool this morning and somebody brought up a good point like with all these venues that they have on the ship the very least they can do is guarantee like, hey, at this particular venue, at this time, we have this DJ. You can listen to hip hop, R&B, blah, 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 blah. But then somebody else in that group said, well, maybe they don't want us all together. Maybe they don't want us all together congregating. Last night, we went to the club. It was my first night out. And we went to the manor. And the DJ played, Kesha, don't stop, make it drop. Why are you playing this? Uh... That's my teeth with a bottle with Jack. On an all adult ship, no kids, we want to stay up, we want to party, but the playlists have to be better. Even if you play like Billboard's Top 40, I don't listen to the radio, I listen exclusively to Spotify. Play what's on the radio. A little bit of something for everybody. Also, I don't want to hear Taylor Swift over and over and over and over, but throw some Taylor Swift in there for the Taylor, for the Swifty girls. It has to be more diverse than just listening to Bad Bunny for hours. I can't take it and i don't want to listen to yeah 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 i don't want to listen to hip-hop and r&b and rap music from 2010 well play something more current please we are begging you virgin it's the best cruise i've ever been on i love everything the music has to be more diverse and i know y'all can do it. and i'm looking forward to coming back and seeing the improvements that you make and that's not saying like i want to listen to rap and stuff all the time but there should be certain venues for certain things at a pool or something like that it needs to cover all genres of music oh and then they said well, i'm gonna read it to you so you know i'm not putting words in nobody's mouth it sounded kind of racist a little bit like i didn't like exactly how they phrased it oh this this is what i found racist this is, i'm reading directly from here so it's dj james campbell at the aquatic club vibe out in midday sun with strangers lovers and everyone in between at the aquatic club it's all about good energy you'll hear a mix of current and classic pop latin reggae and hip-hop of the chill non-explicit variety dance minimal house music and remixes Perfect for pool size loungy, cocktail optional. So why do you put hip hop, only for hip hop, of the chill, not explicit very, it, look, and I'm not lying, like look at this. Of the chill, so what, so what do you mean hip hop? We gotta, mm, 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 mm. Okay, so I'm gonna eat my salad. Continue watching the gravy movie. doing her puzzle thing. I love that for her because I'm terrible at puzzles. I hate puzzles. I have a puzzle city undone. So now I'm going up to the solo, wait, the deep blue meetup. And I'm excited. Let's meet up with some other people that sell other queens. There's an exclusive cocktail party for deep blue sailors. And I was trying to go to that, but I walked outside and it's raining. So now I'm just outside on a quiet deck, watching the ocean and watching the rain and enjoying my second ever espresso martini. I might try one more time in a few minutes to head upstairs because they had the area blocked off where the meetup was supposed to be. And I thought it would be somebody up there kind of directing, saying, hey, go here instead, but I didn't see anybody. And I guess I'm just not really impressed about it. It'd be nice to meet other people and hear their thoughts, especially because it's my first time on version. I walked back up there to see if they were doing it and I did not see them. So now I have that espresso martini and it did help. I feel so awake right now 
and I feel like I have a lot of energy. Now I'm swinging on this thing here. Q won her puzzle competition. I'm so happy for her because if I was with them, I would have made them lose because I would really suck at puzzles. So we're going to go meet them for the solo singer meetup on deck seven and I'm running late. Oh, look at my little winner. Like, hey. Look at my winner. I'm so happy for her. Less than 30 minutes. Less. A full, what, it was like 300 pieces, right? Yeah, I think it should be actually, I guess the world record of World record. So I said, oh, I was like, help me that. Like minutes, but we uh, finished Close. definitely, I think, in like 20 minutes. I love that. <laughs> I came back to the room because I needed to put on deodorant because I forgot to put some on after my shower and I put myself getting a little sweaty. Let's go be social. Tonight's also test kitchen night. Take the champagne and let's go do the things with the people. To our um, palate cleanser. Oh, boy. Hi. Hello. Drink here at Test Kitchen tonight. Here. That's really good, actually. It was really good. It looks like foam, right? Red, really Oh, that tastes like um, spiking, sparkling cider liquor in my head. Oh, hi, video. Hmm. Seaweed. Seaweed, yeah. There it goes. Mmm, that salad is so good. Third course drink. Third course. What? Ginger something. Oh! It's ginger. It has a candy to it. Very ginger. Oh my god. I don't like that one. That one I do not like. Cheers. <laughs> Taste all the bitter. Very bitter. Ooh. So this is chocolate. Let's see what it's called. Chocolate. Actually, not bad. Blue cheese is interesting pre dessert. <laughs> That was really brave. I'm so proud of you. It's really brave. You took a big chunk of that. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, look at her. I love blue cheese, but I was not about to do that. Look at this tiny little <laughs> mouse <laughs> niblet. <laughs> Literally a niblet I took. We made it to the final drink. That wraps up whatever day this is, Monday. Tomorrow is our last day on the ship. We're in Bimini, Bahamas. We just left Test Kitchen, which was interesting. I'm full though. That's just good. I am full. I'm about to turn these lights and go to bed. I'm so tired. Next cruise I go on, I'll do all the fun things. But this cruise, I didn't have it in me. Good morning and welcome to the very last day, unfortunately, of this cruise. Um, we are in Bimini, Bahamas. I cannot be that late. Come on, stop playing with me. All right. <laughs> we are in Bimini, Bahamas today. We docked around eight. We just got clearance and it's almost 10 o'clock. I signed up for a yoga class, so I need to go to yoga. It's windy and it's cold outside. So we're gonna get off the ship a little bit later just because we're here till like 6 p.m. So I figure there's no big rush. Let's go to yoga. My only critique about these elevators are that you never know. It doesn't make a sound. They just, oh wait, they make a sound? <laughs> Never mind, take that back. Pilates class, so my body's kind of hurting just a little bit, but it hurts in a good way. So as I go get my bathing suit, but a couple doors down from me, there's security always sitting inside this room. I'm talking about 24 seven security sitting outside this room. The last like three days actually. So today I asked my cabin steward and I was like, hey, is that person like on cabin arrest? He's like, yeah. I said, what they do? <laughs> Being drunk in the air fighting. So they've been in there for the last couple days. Don't spend your money. And they're inside an inside cabin. Imagine not even having a view, have to sit in there for that many days. I would be like distraught personally. So, mm -mm. figure out how to get off the ship. Overcast. We're gonna make the best of it. Welcome to Bimini. Bimini the Bahamas.
Yeah, this might be a sh ship day for us. I know this water's about to be freezing. Oh, heck no. We try to go to extra virgin, but getting into extra virgin is like damn getting into like a Michelin star restaurant. Like they not letting you in. I tried two nights in a row. That's the one place we did not have reservations to. Delicious. I like ones with some. I got hot sauce in my bag. Swag. Let me honestly say. Then we upgrade a little bit. And we got oysters too. I don't know how y'all like to eat y'all oysters, but I like mine. But lemon juice, horseradish, and cocktail sauce. My toxic trait is, Okay. Sure. I know I can tear up those 48 oysters. That's fine. With the lemon drop. Look at you, look at you. Oh my gosh, am I not going? You have gross? some oysters and the lemon drops. I am dying. Yeah. Mad disrespectful, like. Cause that's what we serve in front of y'all like this, honestly. But she was like, let me finish up at the way. That was good. I know words, cause that was very good. Because extra version, y'all didn't want to let us in. Y'all feel like I'm Michelin star or whatever. But it's okay, it's okay. But I did hear the extra version had one of the best steaks on the ship. It's okay, I'll come back and we'll try it again. That's gonna be the first thing I booked. Two TC3s and tequila soda waters. <laughs> Lemon drops are beating my ass right now. First version cruise, I will be back. Carnival, you're done with. Actually, no. <laughs> For five hundred dollars. No, that's five hundred dollars. I will, I will slide the five hundred like this. I will be on a carnival cruise. I would be. The thing is, every time I go on a five, like a cheap carnival cruise, I end up spending the same amount on the ship as I do. I'm gonna show y'all my wallet to show y'all I'm not BSA. So fifty-two dollars, and I still have a hundred and six dollars left to spend on alcohol. <laughs> Well, I have four drinks right now. Damn, number one, two is not a winner, and three, nobody remembers. I hate it. Playing a little Boosie on it. Boosie, Thank you on the ones and twos, aka okay, this little playlist thing. We've been drinking, we've been drinking. Woo! Trying to find a casino so we can go to the manor, to the manor. Ooh, how's it my last night? I'm staying up the latest tonight. What a fun night. And now I'm trying my burger. This better be the best burger two nights in a row at midnight. And she keeps talking about the fries. This better be the best burger I ever had in my life. <sighs> Y'all. I'm tired. My food. I have my drink and my two step. Well, I think this kind of kind of wraps up our cruise a little bit. You know? After 20 cruises. 20. Yes, this is my 20th one. This is top five. This might be top two. Let me pack and we'll be back. I wanna watch see me pack. Let's let's pack together. Get ready with me to get off the ship. like that i'm kind of sad i'll be back for sure i was supposed to hang out in miami but miami looks like this right now miami looks like this i also like to give a special shout out to the bird poop 
that's been on my window <laughs> for all the days. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, I told you on my first day, you were a good luck charm. You were, this has been a great cruise. They just did the, hey, you still on the ship, please. If you're not selling with us on the next voyage, please leave. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. I gotta go rest up because India's next. So, ooh, Jesus. All right, bye guys.